We've got a breaking story. Yes. It seems Amy Winehouse broke out of rehab. I told you. And is causing Woo! problems on the strip at the Brooklyn Bridge. There she is, and she does not look happy. Amy, what is going on? How'd you get out? Jason, let me tell you for starters, I was never in rehab. You've got it wrong. I do not have a drug problem. And I just wanted to tell you that this morning when I got up, I went for a nice little jog along the strip and I had some broccoli. So you're completely wrong. <laughs> hey. <laughs> that's awesome. Very nice. Amy. Did that sort of seem like Amy? Yeah, it sounded like her. More. <laughs> yeah, I need to, need to slur a little bit more. Hey, this Brooklyn Bridge is really cool. It's transformed into a haunted house, and we're going to show you how you can have some Halloween scares coming up. All right. And you need a haunted house when you've got a haunted bridge. Why would you need one? We're going to check back in with a special correspondent, Amy Winehouse, a.k.a. Claudine Grant, to get the details on this over-the-top Halloween. It is like the time of the year where the most sweets are consumed. Claudine, I, I, mean, I mean, Amy Winehouse, is live with more on that. Uh, with the British accents? I'm sorry, what was that? It's very loud here. There's trucks going by and stuff. Say that again. Well, you actually just answered my question. I said with the British accent, and you do have the British yes. accent. Yes, thank you. You know, teeth are very important, Jason. Although I have several missing and people think it's because of drugs, actually, I used to play hockey. That's what <laughs> uh, happened. I lost those teeth to hockey. But you've got to take care. <laughs> All right, I got to stop that. You've got to take care of your teeth. Seriously, like on Halloween time, you want to make sure that your teeth are looked after. And we know that parents are dipping into their kids' Halloween. Bag. So this is for parents and children. It not only affects the waistline, those treats, it also affects, of course, teeth. Here's how to take care of them. All right, so parents and kids, make sure that you brush and floss. Now, as you can see, I've made a few new friends here at the New York, New York Hotel and Casino. Yes, did you know, they tell me that the Brooklyn Bridge here is haunted. <laughs> It's something. Coming up, I'm going to tell you how you can hang out with these monsters on board. Uh, all right, well, uh, don't bring your friends to the studio. Okay, there, uh, Amy. You don't want to see okay, your we'll chainsaw? Talk to you later. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. man. Oh, Monica, Rachel. Uh, I don't think Amy Winehouse has ever looked that good. Oh. oh, Amy Winehouse live. There she is, and she looks mad. <laughs> well, you know. We are here at New York, New York Hotel and Casino, and we are on my car, the hearse, because it's nap time, and we are hiding from all of the ghouls that are out there because they say that the Brooklyn Bridge is haunted. <laughs> all right, if you are... Coming up, we'll tell you how you and your family can come and see a great show tonight. All right, if you are frightened by... The bridge at New York, New York this morning, <laughs> Winehouse joins us now live. That really does smell. Hey, Amy, I think you never cleaned up so good before in your life. <laughs> well, thank you. I don't need rehab. This is just proof. You know, you cannot put eyeliner on like this when you're on drugs. Oh, no, no, put you can't. They're doing Charlie's Angels. This is a pro. This is the updated version of the Charlie's Angels. What do you think? <laughs> um, Farrah is missing. <laughs> But we yeah, have a ring girl. <laughs> hey, you know what? This is so cool. Thanks, guys. This is so cool. I want to introduce you to Seth. Now, Seth here, we got to get some shots back here. Seth, you are involved here. You helped put this thing together. You've got the whole thing going on. What can we expect? I mean, this is so fun for the family. This is a, it's a very large haunted house. It's actually much bigger than it looks. It goes all the way across the Brooklyn Bridge, 3,000 square feet, lots of rooms, lots of great actors inside. Uh, it's, it's a very scary haunted house. So this is the first year that New York, New York has actually done this and transformed the Brooklyn Bridge with all the ghosts and goblins. How has the response been so far? Because uh, it looks pretty amazing. We can't get inside just yet. It's, uh, it's been overwhelming. You know, and what's really funny is even if you can't get inside, we have uh, nine fine Irishmen overlooks, the patio overlooks the exit of the, of the haunted house. So what happens is people sit there for hours drinking, just watching people screaming as they run outside of the, of the uh, haunted house. So we've seen some of the actors here. How many in the show, and and what are we going to get inside there? Like, is it is it a maze going on, or what's inside that tent? It's a maze of rooms. We uh, we hire about 25 actors a day, and uh, they we pride ourselves on just really trying to catch everyone off guard and make this as as exciting experience as possible. So. Scariest thing in there? Can you can you reveal anything? Trying to get some information from him now. Well, I, you know, you don't want to give it away. It's not scary if you know it's coming. I guess that's true. I guess that's true. Okay, so who could come here? What ages and what's the price? 
Well, we're, we're open to all ages, but we suggest that uh, kids 12 and under be, uh, be accompanied by an adult, and it's a $20 ticket. Okay, cool. And what time does it open? We open at 6 p.m., and we're open until very late. 6 p.m. until the wee hours of the night. So even after you finish your trick-or-treating and brushing your teeth after you eat that candy, you can come and check this out. All right, Rachel, you got to come and see it. There's some, there's some handsome men here. I know you're single. I know you're looking. <laughs> I found some dates for us. Well, I have a double date. Set up the double date and I'm in. <laughs> see, I'm, I'm thinking this one for you, Rachel. Okay, let's okay, see. Okay, this guy for you. All right. Yeah, they and have then two babies. this guy for me because he's got a chainsaw, so I know he's handy around the home. Of course, you pick the guy he with the better teeth. So selfish, Claudia. You could probably pick some plumbing. <laughs> Something. Right? Did she say? He could fix some no, what? What did she say? She said it. We're going to move along, little doggy, but that's good. Thanks so much. Let's go to the Halloween -y. Jason. <laughs> is, that why it, is that why I don't have any kids? All right. Okay. okay. Sorry. See Sorry. You Come later. back. Come on. Come back. <laughs>